What does your dad do for work? I think he measures the rivers and he takes out like the speed of them too. What does USGS stand for? Um, United States? No, wait. I really don't. Do you remember Hurricane Maria? Um, me acuerdo que yo estaba sentada en un cuartito um, viendo por la ventana, había mucho viento, mucha lluvia. Um, todos tuvimos que dormir en un mismo cuarto con una linterna, una lucecita. Why should kids care about science? Um, yo pienso que deben de entender más ciencia porque ahí hay cosas bien cool y ahí pues, te ayudan a entender más las cosas. Becoming a hydrotech is, is nice because you got the best of the both environments, be in the field and also have some time in the in the office. So you don't get bored on any of them. It's always a different uh, challenging way to, to see it in the field. And also in the office you got some time to be in an air conditioning environment and, and still do some computer work that we need to do. What you do in the field is being published. People can see it publicly and you can actually tell what's going on and how they use the, that data to preserve life or property in some instances. So, and also taking uh, some key decisions on how to use the water or how to manage the water system in the, in the island. Here, the first thing I do when I come into the office is check all the stations, make sure they're all transmitting, giving the data correctly. If not, I would need to go out to the field and fix them. My assigned stations are on the northwest part of the island, so it's around two hours driving. Once you get there, that part is uh, very hot, but also very humid. In the afternoon, usually it rains a lot. So they're big rivers. Uh, so steep banks, there's a lot of debris, there's a lot of vegetation. Uh, sometimes it's really easy to access them, sometimes it's, it's not. There's a, when river uh, gets high, it erodes the banks, and so it's even difficult to get to the water itself. Usually you do at least three stations per day if everything goes smooth. If, if there's a, a problem or you need to fix something, it can take you the whole day. Being MacGyvers is true, uh, we need to fix them, uh, sometimes it, we got replacements, sometimes we don't, sometimes we get there and we don't have the equipment needed to fix it, so we need to improvise with uh, small tools and just make it work. That's, that's the, the main purpose of going out to the station is that you left leaving that station in working conditions and, and can be accurate, the, the data that is given out. So this is a water quality monitor. It has uh, several sensors that measure different parameters. This one in particular has sensor that measures temperature and specific ductance. This one measures uh, turbidity of the water. This sensor measures the pH of the water and the dissolved oxygen of the water. In 2017, we had a huge hurricane, it's uh, Hurricane Maria. It destroyed most of our stations, uh, so it was field work for, I can say, at least a year of field work every single day, going out, trying to repair the stations as quickly, quickly possible uh, to make them work and be useful for emergency management agencies. For Maria, we didn't have uh, electricity for a few months. Uh, we didn't have communications either. So it was pretty hard to, to, to do the logistics, to do the stations. It, it was a difficult time. At the same time, it's, you feel the, the need to do it because you know that data will help at some point the, the civilians around the, the, the area. Every part of my job is being in the field. I, I can, it's always great to be in the field. It's always something different in the field. Uh, sometimes it, yes, it's raining, sometimes it's really hot, but at the end it's, it's an experience and there's always something new to, to make a story out of it. <laughs>